pieces by my fans. But this show's really getting to me, Jules. I'm adoring it. Can you imagine five hours of rock and roll? When I was young, five hours of foxtrot would have been inconceivable. Are you, are you enjoying any of the bands particularly who we're having on at the moment? No, but I'm having a lovely time all the same. Isn't it super? Is it, it, does it remind you of any particular experiences of, of large crowds that you've seen before? Well, yes, I've had a lot of experience of large crowds, and I've had a lot of experience of fame and success too, and I've been able to pass along a lot of this experience to the pitiful young pop stars who write to me asking for help. But goodness, I'm loving it. I'm loving the company of young people. And also, of course, I'm privileged to be here tonight. It's such a special night for you, darling, isn't it? Yes. Tell me why, and tell our viewers. Um, this is my last tube, and so onions are being handed out in the interval. It's the last tube. Well, I haven't got many more either. <laughs> no, it's, it's a very, very sad evening for us all. Uh, also, I, I noticed that because of all the huge crowds there tearing at you, is it, is it something that... That is, is upsetting in a position of, of fame. Just... Something's tearing at my heart too, Jules. There was also a tragedy out there, as we said. Several people yeah. were crushed. I, uh, <laughs> there were so many people in there. I thought there'd be a tragedy. <laughs> I'm afraid there was. <laughs> Several people were crushed. To death, yes. That's no, right. no, no, no. Radically, though. <laughs> <laughs> well, but my heart is crushed with emotion, and I think a little presentation Well, no, nice. I think not yet, but no. not yet. I'm going to present this microphone to Paula to tell you all about what's happening have now. have a whip around <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> What's coming next, darling? Well, what's on next is... Well, it was meant to be Robert Plant, but right. Robert... Wasn't. So instead, we've got... That was meant to be a Birmingham accent, and we've...